Einstein's discoveries in physics range from the molecular to the universe. His formative years, the years of his unequal creativity, were spent here in Switzerland. In his education and his character may be revealed answers to the riddle of the world Now that Einstein submitted to the Thank you. 
according to the child's atomistic hierarchy. There is a structure law, which means, according to billions, millions and millions of children, that the substructure of a proton or neutron is a smaller elementary particle, a smaller universe, which on the structure of the field, which is available on Kindle, describes as a maximum galactic assemblage to the negative one. What does that mean? It's very simple. It's a smaller dimension of matter's construction. It has a superposition of gravitational fields from smaller elementary particles of construction, exactly as Carl Sagan says. So we will write it simply as MGA to the negative one. MGA to the negative one is a structure law. Hans Albert Einstein. I'm sure he, he agreed completely. So we write down the new enriched structure law to the e equals MC squared. We're writing it down simply here as a summation, a linear summation. That's what this symbol means. Smaller elementary particle, P to the negative one in the child's atomistic hierarchy. One over R squared. Ein Newtonian, Einsteinian gravitational fields. So from a smaller dimension of matter, matter construction, the gravitational fields from 10 to the 80th of the smaller child's atomistic hierarchy. Smaller dimensions of matter construction. Their gravitational fields diverge infinitely far, right from the surface of our P naught elementary particle, which is a neutron, proton, electron. Smaller dimension of matter construction diverge like also sprouts of the structure and extend into here. This is a one over r squared. This is the child structure law behind E equals MC squared, which you Using see there. Solid thermonuclear a proton is a maximum, a smaller Teller and Stan Newman, galactic universe, to producing aircraft just as ours bombs is a and more effective weapons. unit universe as we look outward.
Make no mistake, this is a grab by a clever, devious, and power-hungry man. On 31 October 1972, Professor H. J. Treaders of the German Academy of Sciences, as did Professors de Broy and Courier of the French Academy of Sciences, also acknowledged receiving on the structure of the field and the essay, what is a completely unified pure field theory. Again, on the structure of the field is an axiomatic treatise considering the child's atomistic hierarchy with the keen observation that the one over R squared universal gravitational field is the only field which is globally present throughout and unifying the infinite atomistic hierarchy. That observation stemmed from my childhood experience, experiments with a magnet in the fall, with magnets in the fall of my fourth year in 1950. By the way, in April of 1950, Albert Einstein wrote the April months, only a few months before, wrote the Scientific America, American article. Uh, on the generalized theory of gravitation in which he tried to, Einstein tried to explain that he was trying to unify the electric magnetic field with the gravitational field. And he compared his attempts in the Scientific American to the miracle creed of Lucretius, going all the way back to the, to the Greeks. I was then four years old. The solution to Einstein's problem was well on the way. <laughs> 